Hey, Dennis here, and uh, I'm back out on location today painting. And uh, we've got a really nice day here in Michigan, so I'm pretty excited about today. It's going to be sunny, and uh, I hear our weather's going to tank after this, so I'm um, going to make the best of it today, hopefully get in a couple paintings. I want to show you the scene um, I've chosen today. Um, this particular scene, uh, I really like the way this hillside in the distance kind of climbs uh, up onto that uh, ridge and um, it's not very often I get a lot of clear views like this to a ridge line but uh, off to the right you can see there's a there's a marsh uh, out here that's still very very blonde in color um, but I like the way this grass which is just starting to turn a little bit green kind of leads up to this tree on the right and you've got the opening to see the hill and then off into the distance on the left there is a uh, uh, just a peak of a, a building that's back there. I kind of like the way the sky's reflecting off the top of that and then the the nice um, real light value uh, kind of a beige color on the trees and then I'm hoping to pull in a little bit of these uh, uh, pine trees that are on the left just to add some uh, color to to this scene and I think picking up the green from the trees, the green in the grass and a little bit of green that's peeking through on the hillside will will add enough color for uh, for interest so um, I'll get uh, I'll get going here and uh, we'll see what we can do today Okay, I'm feeling pretty good about this uh, about the start here um, don't really have any serious uh, trouble spots yet uh, this uh, I like this tree over here and now I'm gonna just kind of fill in uh, kind of get some of these other other cast of characters in here I've got uh, I've got this one tree, which kind of wants to run up the middle, but I need to move it over a little bit because I don't want anything uh, cutting right through the center of the painting here. So, And if I dropped it in where it looks like it's going to go toward the center, um, I would actually end up moving that. Uh, I'll have a couple options. I can either lean it uh, out of the center. Um, And this is what happens when you when you paint uh, plein air, and you're, you're you're trying to trying to pull a uh, composition together at the same time. And what's in reality occasionally doesn't really work out on canvas as far as the positioning of some of these characters. So you have to you have to kind of play with that a little bit and kind of keep the main thing the main thing so to speak and in this particular case what attracted me to this scene in the first place is actually this hillside back here um, like I mentioned earlier the way that rises uh, up into here and fall is and so so I've positioned it um, in my composition where it falls in this bottom this bottom third quadrant because um, it's kind of where I want I want to lead you through the through the painting uh, to get back here to what I'm most excited about. So these things are in the foreground. They just have to help support this message. So uh, so I'm going to kind of work on that now and uh, we'll check it out.
All right, so um, up next is to start uh, working on this background tree line, and I want to make sure I get my uh, my focus area really established, and then because everything else in the whole painting pretty much has to relate to this, both in uh, value and uh, contrast, and well, not necessarily contrast. Highest contrast has to be forward, but um, anyway, and the values of this. Uh, have to make sure that this is popping, you know, more than this over here, which I think, you know, this is going to have to be dealt with in a number of ways. But first of all, it's a little too, a little too symmetrical, and just by doing this or moving my finger around, I can, uh, I can soften that. So I'll get going on this tree line here and uh, and this uh, focus area. See if I can't get that developed. Okay, so the, this is where I'm going to stop today. Um, uh, this one uh, had some challenges, and uh, I'm not completely sure that I'm 100% happy with it. But uh, hopefully, I can uh, hopefully I can salvage it when I get home. What's really bothering me is I'm having trouble with these two color bands um, and really drawing attention to what I wanted to. So. Um, I don't feel uh, super good about this one, but you know, when I get home and uh, study it for a while, chances are I'll be able to salvage it. But either way, that's plein air painting. You never know. So I love the scene, totally inspired by it. And uh, hopefully I can make something out of this and I will catch you next time. See you later.